Ah, the Thelos Islands. Two sides of the same coin. Thelos, sacred birthplace of Artemis and Apollo, and Mykonos, where people do everything that's forbidden on Thelos. Read me the note again. Eagle-bearing Mystios. That's you. Otharkis, cruel leader of Delos Islands, takes money from our pockets and food from our mouths, all to feed his inset... inseti... Insatiable. Yes! His insatiable thirst for power. Otharkis is one of them, Barnavas. The ones hunting my family. Keep reading. We are a modest but fierce group of rebels who'd pay you handsomely to help us overthrow our vile oppressor. I pray the winds guide you swiftly to our shores, Mystios. Our people are dying. Signed, Kira. We arrived just in time to help. You see? Poseidon wasn't trying to drown you. He was getting you where you needed to go. Aggressively. Does the note say where Kira is? There are two locations marked. A camp along the northwestern coast and a hideout that looks like it's underneath the city. Udarki sounds like a cruel man. He's worse. I once heard a family was late in paying their dues to the gods. Botharki sent his men to their farm and took the young ones from their beds. When their mater and pater woke up to feed the animals, they discovered the animals were already feeding on the corpses of their sons. The sooner I send this monster to Hades, the better. Even Hades would shudder in his presence. It's time I met with this Kira. I'll have the ship ready in case we need any... immediate departures. Duh, that was Kefalonia. And that was mostly your fault. Ha-ha! <laughs> Here, Alexios. Here, Varnavas. I'm looking for the one called Kira. I've come in response to a call for help. You missed. Are you here to spy, Athenian? Or maybe you are Athena herself, dressed in a dirty disguise? Do I really look like a spy to you? Podarkis and his men have been hunting and killing us without mercy. His spies are everywhere. He won't rest until all who oppose him are dead. We are all that's left of the resistance. This is the first night we aren't fighting for our lives. And it could be our last. And suddenly, you show up. This is why I'm here. It's your symbol, right? You're the Mystios who bears the Eagle of Zeus. My apologies. These are dangerous times for anyone waging war against the Athenian Empire and the Delian League. I am Kira. I thought Delos was the heart of the Diliagi League, Athens' pride and joy. We were, until Athens took the League's treasury away from Delos. Why? So they could build a statue of Athena mocking Apollo. The people pleaded with Podarchis not to trust Athens with the treasury, but his thirst for power made him deaf to his people. Your note mentions Podarkis. I'm going to find him. His house is on the coast, uh, north of Mykonos city. But he's heavily guarded. We've never been able to get close enough without taking heavy casualties. This is why I sent for you. 
I came here to help you deal with one man, not go to war. Which is why I sent word of a rebellion to the mighty Alexios, and Sparta too. Podarkis discovered the other cap and sent Athenian soldiers to attack. Malaka! You and your rebels are too drunk to fight. Leave the soldiers to me. <laughs> if you think I'm going to miss a chance to kill Athenians, you're the one who's drunk. Ah, you fought well, Kira. You too, Spartan? I was, but that was a long time ago. Spartan blood is eternal, stranger. What's your name? This is Alexios, the one I told you about. They call me Thaletas. I was Polemarchos to the Spartans here. Was? Our ship was sunk. Our generals killed. There are only a few of us left. We've all lost friends to this war. And we will mourn them later. She's right. We shouldn't be standing here drenched in Athenian blood. We'll be safe in the hideout. Let's talk there. Will you come to the hideout now or meet us there later? There's no time to waste. We'll go to the hideout now. How long till Podarkis finds us? We're right under his nose! His nose is so high in the air, he couldn't find the statue of Artemis Agrotera if he was standing on her head! We know where he lives! I say we knock down his door and run our spears through his face. That's a terrible plan. The Spartan phalanx is impenetrable in a ground assault. Not when there's only 12 of you. You think with your heart. That's what I like about you. But you're a general. To those men now, you need to think with your head. All you do is hide in caves and lurk in shadows. We didn't come here to hide. We came here to fight. And we will. But right now, we're outnumbered. We must be strategic. Alexios, what do you think we should do? Kira's right. Taking them head on would be suicide. Sailing here was suicide! Right now, my men are on the beach. That's where I'll be. Then let us don't! If you decide you actually want to win this rebellion, come find me. Ugh, Spartans. Don't mind him. He'll be fine after he kicks something. But I'm glad you agree with me, Alexios. Meet me at the Temple of Artemis. There we can discuss how to take down Podarkis. Alexios, I'm glad you came. I'm glad you didn't throw another blade at me. I know, I know. You came all this way and I was cruel to you. Well, you weren't the first. And you won't be the last. Villians are kind people. At least we were. Before him. Bodarkis. That man's been hunting me my whole life. Bodarkis and others like him want me and my family dead. He executed my family when I was very little. I survived on the streets, was raised by hunters, rogue warriors, and mercenaries like you. They are my family now. And one day, I will fire an arrow into his black heart. One for every Dillian family he's destroyed. Then it's time we turn this predator into prey. How do we get past his guards? Soldiers need two things to fight. Swords in their hands, and food in their bellies. Take them away, and the guards fall. Scouts reported Podarkis' supplies and weapons were stockpiled in the old ruins on Delos Island. <laughs> in the ruins on Delos? It's not much of a stockpile anymore. What? Why? I've already been there. That's wonderful! And? Did you make Podarkis feel our sting? Podarkis' guards will have to fight with their fists and on empty stomachs from now on. 
Excellent. So, what will you do once Podarkis is dead and the rebellion is won? The sad truth is I have no idea. For as long as I can remember, every day has been a struggle to live, to love. Vengeance has all but consumed me. And what will Alexios do once this is over? We have a lot in common. I was hoping when the smoke clears, we could find somewhere quiet. And what exactly do we have in common? I know you've struggled to get where you are. You've had to fight and claw for everything you have. I know, because I've done the same. We're survivors. I'm glad the gods brought you to our source, Alexios. Some time alone would be nice. You must have many tales. It's time we got going. When Podarkis learns of what happened on Dilos, he'll want revenge. And the first to suffer will be the Dilians. Here. Where's Kira? She's... Miss me already, Mistyos? Kira, there is something I need to tell you. That look on your face, so serious. Sit, relax, drink some wine. What I'm about to say is for you alone. Follow me. Now that you have me all alone, what is it you want to tell me? <sighs> there is no other way to say this. Podarkis is your father. <laughs> what sort of joke is this? This isn't a joke. <sighs> I will kill you where you stand! This can't be. Gira, I'm sorry. He took everything from me. How do you find this? I found your old house. I know about your mother. I can still hear her screams. A storm of blue armor and red blades tore through our home. I had to run through mother's blood to escape. I never returned to that place. It was best you didn't. It's good you told me in private. The men don't need to know this, not yet. But please, leave me for a while. I need to be alone. The Athenians are weak. Now we strike Podarkis, where he'll hurt most. His kidneys? <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you, Kira. Since you came here, I've actually started to believe we can win this rebellion. So, you were saying we strike? Guards protect the island's treasury in one location. If we find it and steal it, the soldiers go unpaid, unfed, and unarmed. Podarkis will finally be vulnerable. Then we can stick our blades in between his ribs, feed his liver to the dogs. Before we start feeding organs to animals, can you get me to the nation's purse? Our spies have located it in Miltiadis' fort. I'll have Praxos gather the troops. It's best if it's just the two of us. Easier to sneak in and out undetected. You just want me all to yourself, don't you? Let's get going, then. Alexios, there you are. Good news, I hope. When the people of Dilos discover Podarkis lost every coin of their nation's treasure, ha, they're going to rip him to pieces. You weakened Athens' grip over Dilos, exposed Podarkis, and made way for a Spartan alliance. I could kiss you. I don't see anything holding you back. You breathed life into me. If only you'd arrived on Velos before Thaletas.
These are dangerous times. I'd hate to meet Hades without having tasted those lips. <laughs> Very poetic for someone covered in blood. I like it. Do you even recognize me in the underworld? I wonder. We should probably move. They're going to come looking for us. I don't think I've ever really said thank you for coming here. You've given us hope. I'll go back to the hideout. But if you keep this up, Podarkis is as good as dead. I may finally know peace. I'm looking for Kira. Not here. Gone hunting. Once you're with her, she said. I mean, where is she? Praying to the gods for a good hunt. The altar of Artemis, east from here, on the north bit of Tavern Point. Thanks. Keen-eyed Artemis, guide my bow. I pray to you with all my heart, and Alexios doesn't scare off the animals with his heavy footsteps. I thought I was being quiet. If that was you being quiet, we'll have nothing but trampled grass to eat for dinner. Nice altar. The flowers remind me of sweeter days. But your real concern should be, how skilled are you with that bow? I don't need to pray to the gods to hit my targets. <laughs> They've been known to disguise themselves as animals. I just like to warn them I'm coming. Because I always hit my targets. Sounds like a challenge. Come, the Ibex is swift. We're not going to catch any by standing and chatting. My people will be well fed, and the gods will have their sacrifice, thanks to you. You're a great hunter. Why did you actually want me here? Don't be naive. There's something between us, even though I know I shouldn't act on it. Because you love Thaletas. Or at least I thought I did, until you arrived. The hunt clears my mind, to reflect on the words that passed between us. Is that a good thing? I know a spot down by the water. It's quiet. We'll be alone. What do you say? I'm all yours. <laughs> <laughs> no. So the pirate has one blade at my throat and one at my stomach, and he says, how do you want to die, Mistios? Fast or slow? My gods, what did you do? He was so focused on me, he never noticed my spear in his leg. He was dead before he knew what happened. His leg? A little trick my mother taught me. Why is it so easy to talk with you? Because we've lived similar lives. Been through similar struggles, even though we grew up so far apart. I want you, Alexios. Here, now, under the stars. I've wanted you since I laid eyes on you. Mykonos is definitely my favorite island. <laughs> and you're my favorite, Mistios. The Letas should know about this. He will, in time. For now, he needs to focus on the rebellion. So do we. But, uh, first...
people are happy. As they should be! For the first time since Ares cursed us with war, the Delos Islands know freedom! But where is Kira? It's not like her to miss a chance to drink with her troops. She told me you kept her secret. I'm still shocked. Otharkis was a complicated man, but he was still her father. She snuck off to send him to the ferryman alone. All good warriors deserve their send-off, I suppose. Even Podarkis. Pray that we're shown the same kindness when our time comes. In the meantime, there is wine to be drunk and tales to be told. <laughs> Make the tale great. The troops deserve it. The Letas especially. Certainly, if you can find him. And when you do, remind him, I still plan to tell him how I lost this eye. And the crew? Ready to sail? On your order! But first, let the crew enjoy a drink and a song. You deserve one too. What is the ferryman? Go now, into the river of black night, and embrace the boundless gloom. You shall wander, obscure, even in the house of Hades, flitting among the sad of the dead. You shouldn't have to say goodbye alone. I'm glad I'm not alone. I've wanted to watch him burn for so long. Now that it's happened, I thought I'd feel peace. And what do you feel? I used to feel vengeful. Now, empty. I was in your place once. The vengeance dies, then the emptiness dies too. Give it time. Time! I gave my entire life! I want it done. Kronos devours his children, rips them flesh from bone. Zeus had Prometheus torn open by beds for an eternity. Fate is cruel, and the gods are wicked. Right here, right now, all that matters are the people who have fought for you. They need you now, not the gods. You're right. They do need me. And I need them. We're rebels with nothing left to rebel against. They need me now more than ever. Thank you. What will you do next? Mykonos will need to rebuild. Then that's what we'll do. But not to put it back as it was, not as Father wanted. We'll make this place a new home for our people to be free. To live good lives. Gera, he's gone. Your rebels are waiting. They're celebrating. <sighs> Let's celebrate with them. Goodbye. Look ready to go. Odarkis is gone, Kira's with the rebels, and I have other targets to hit. Then we sail! But first, I may have told Kira you'd give a speech to the rebels before saying goodbye. Let's say goodbye. Character! Settle down! Settle down! Alexios has something he would like to say. Freedom! So celebrate! Let the Unisos fill your cup and the muses sing your songs! And now 
a toast to Alexios, to victory! A fine speech, though I'm not sure many of these rebels can imagine a free Dinos. I think they liked it. Of course, of course! Who wouldn't? I'll round up the crew. See you back at the ship? Socrates, the rebels are hunting Athenians. What are you doing here? I came to teach, as I always do, but don't worry. I sail on a merchant ship set for Attica in the morning. Wise as always. Thanks for coming to see us off. Speaking of being off, Barnabas, are we ready to sail? The crew are in fine spirits, if a little hungover. But the ship is ready. Good. I only wish we weren't leaving Kira alone to rebuild her home. Are any of us truly alone who have our friends and allies beside us? Exactly! Do you remember what you told me when you first set foot on these sands? I said we came here to help people. That's what we set out to do, and that's precisely what you did! They don't call you the mighty Mystios for nothing! <laughs> who calls me that? He does. Now then! It's time we give the crew some orders. Where do we sail to next? Ah, the world is ours, and the wind is at our backs. We sail for adventure, Varnavas, just as we always do. <laughs> 